So I think this is the most overlooked role of a deacon, and that, that is to be a safeguarder of unity. It's interesting in Acts 6, the presenting issue on the surface is a mere culinary problem. It's a food squabble. But if you read carefully, actually, there's something much deeper and more serious going on, and that is that there is a impending threat to the very unity of the church for which Christ died. And it's running on a, along a very natural fault line in the church. They, they are functioning to preserve and protect the unity of the church, which means, by the way, you should not make a combative, contentious person a deacon. If someone in your church is always pushing the drama button, if they're the, the kind of person who is accelerating conflict rather than, than squelching it, then they are not yet fit for the office of deacon.